We've just had an election which will see Liz Truss installed as our 56th Prime Minister and amazingly the Queen's 15th PM in her seven-decade reign as monarch. But mark my words, another election could be closer than you think. Liz Truss's immediate challenge in the months ahead is to tackle the soaring cost of living, the catalyst of which is, of course, energy prices. But with energy being sourced from anywhere but Russia right now, with gas, shale, coal, nuclear and renewables being explored and exploited elsewhere, high energy prices ought to correct downwards next year and with it, inflation. Inflation is unlikely to be a long-term threat because the world is in recession and a drop in economic output normally dovetails with a dip in prices. Plus, we can but hope that the war in Ukraine will end. Which is why I think that the Express are not too far off the mark when they splash with this story about speculation there will be a snap election in one year's time. October 2023 is what the Express are suggesting. Now, many think this will be a distraction, but I think it's something our incoming Prime Minister, Liz Truss, should consider seriously. Why? Because, as I said in my big opinion monologue at 9pm, the country will still be in a mess, even in two years' time, when the current parliamentary term comes to an end. And what we need right now is a bit of long-term thinking. If Liz Truss goes to the country in 2023 and wins, that gives her six years from now in which to do some proper planning and genuinely reform this country for the better. If she runs the full term for two and a bit years, which is what she's got left, all you'll have is crisis management and no long-term vision. If she can secure a mandate in one year's time, hopefully having demonstrated during her short stint in office that she's got what it takes, then it would neutralise the threat of big-spending, inflation-busting Labour getting into power in a hellish Britain-hating coalition propped up by the SNP. And it would bring political and economic stability to the country at exactly the time when we need it most. So once we've gone through this inevitable winter crisis, I think another election is a matter of urgency. Liz Truss can go to the country whilst we're still in the throes of this economic crisis and say, folks, I need five years to make Britain great again. An early election will be Truss's trump card. She should play it. What's your view? Should Liz Truss call an election next year and give herself a fresh mandate to govern? Or does she wait until December 2024 and run the clock down? Does Liz go into Fergie time? Uh, let me know your thoughts. Mark at GBnews.uk. Let's ask my brilliant panel. 